Hey guys, welcome to Tuesday. This is actually the like literally the only hat I have in my house. So if it's silly or not, this is the, the only hat I have here. And not not even my dad has a hat. So welcome to Tuesday. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to an awesome Tuesday. Um, it, today's going pretty well so far. I actually, <clears throat> actually just woke up. Like I don't mean I woke up, showered, got dressed, and now I'm here. No, I actually got up, put on a shirt, made some soup, and now I'm here. Yeah, so it was a great day. Look outside. You can see it through my window as I am from. Actually, I'm gonna move this curtain. There we go. It's <coughs> Ouch. Like I said, I made some soup for, well, just in the to cook, but <coughs> I'm actually uh, a bit sick, so I really just made some soup. Oh, that's really good. Um, but for next week, I will, I will get eggs, I'll make an omelet, I'll make hash browns, and I'll cook broccoli, and I'll actually record myself, or I'll do it later this week, and just record myself during the week. Um... So that was just in like cooking challenge and for fair oh man for the happy song. Of course I have that pain. And I'm listening to it right now, but you, you, you I when I listen to it through my headset it doesn't record through uh, the program I'm using, but I'm adding it in, but it's just it's really good song, it's really happy. Um I'm just getting the challenges right out of the way because they're a lot easier than and then talking about normal stuff. AJ said do it on a weird angle, so I think I'll do that next week because I might just record on my phone because then I can I can do curse challenges just to go outside as well. Today I'm just like I said I'm, a, I'm really sick and I'm not dressed because my clothes are in the laundry because I'm a lazy teenager and I forgot to do laundry last night, so it's in the w wash right now. That's why. <laughs> um. For Lauren, she said to do it with someone, and like I said, I'm going to try and do that next week as well. And I'm putting up a lot, but I wrote it down, and I have all the challenges I can do this week. So, the reason why I'm not doing it with someone, though, is I'll actually explain this briefly. I was going to do it with my dad, because the people who live near me are actually Justin and AJ, who are part of Nameless Nerds, and Colin lives with them. But I'm pretty sure AJ wanted to do it with Colin. I don't know. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't talk to him enough. I got a message him. See if he's even home at this time, I don't even know. Um, but my dad works a lot, so he was working yesterday and today. So I'll try and get that next week and get him in my video and make him answer questions because I like hugging him and he can be a part of this. Um, uh, Curtis's challenge was top five baby. This is hard, all right? I hate these kind of questions because for all you people out there who've played games since you were like small. Like, like, you started off with, like, Ataris or uh, Sega Genesis or all the old consoles. You'll know that that's what the favorite game is. You have all these favorite games, not based on, like, newer games. Like, just newer games, but you also love the older games. It's really hard to decide which ones are good. So, I actually... These are just some of my favorites from each of my... Like, each system. system. And I picked series because I couldn't decide on a specific game. Um, so, for my... Uh, for one of my first favorite games uh, for I'm gonna say the PS3 and PS4 would be the infamous series uh, definitely one of my favorite series um, <clears throat> I got infamous one or two just on a whim I got both of them uh, I got one and two uh, on a whim just they look cool I bought them uh, and they're really fun and I actually got second son and that's an amazing game so I picked the infamous series <laughs> it's one it's one of my favorites right now like one of my top favorites uh, when it comes to, I'll actually say the old Game Boy Color, it was Pokemon It was Pokemon Red, which I talked about before on one of my earlier videos. It was, <clears throat> it was one of the first uh, games I got. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I'm really sorry, guys. <laughs> well, but um, it was one of the first games I got because I got a Game Boy as one of my first systems, and I got Red with it, so it was really fun. Um, for the Super Nintendo, definitely the Super Nintendo, it, w it was Chrono Trigger. Um, I got Chrono Trigger when I was, phew, I don't remember, it was very small. My, my dad got it, because my dad uh, loved playing video games. Uh, 
mean, I loved the Chrono Triggers. Uh, Chrono Trigger Final Fantasy, he played this kind of game, so he actually bought that for me to play. And I've been playing it ever since I was younger. Uh, so it's three. Um, my fourth one would have to be probably... Ooh, I want to say uh, PS1, uh, Legend of Dragoon. Uh, if you don't know what it is, I suggest you look it up. It's really fun game. It's... I want to say it's it has a Final Fantasy kind of style, but when you attack it, um, let's say you attack with oh crap, I don't remember his name. Oh, it's gonna bug me. When you attack with your character, a little square will zoom into the uh, a little like a red outline of a square will zoom into a little red square, and when it flashes white, you just suppress square, and it does a critical hit. So it's a really cool system. keep drinking soup this is really good um oh, i need one more what's a really good one i'm trying to think of all like all the systems i've ever played and it's, it's really hard i'll go for an old arcade game which is digga dug i love digga dug i actually got the greatest arcade hits for gamecube and digga dug it had uh galka I feel like I said that wrong, a lot of people are going to hate me for it. But I love Digga Dug, it was a really fun game when I was smaller, and it, it's still fun, I, I love it, it's a great game. Um, actually, on my video, on my last week video, uh, Ken, Kenny Cheesecake, or Christine, as we know who you are, you commented that you won my, my top, one of my, uh, my top games, so, like, there's, there's five. Um, I guess I'll add another one, which is, like, the Prototype series. Which, the difference between the Prototype series and the Infamous series is... You feel so much more stronger because you literally you can buy an upgrade in the prototype too where bullets just deflect off you so you just walk towards people and you kind of tear them apart yeah it happens um nicole was the funny hat like in my house i only have that ice king crown i have nothing else i have no other hat i don't own any hats um i used to but then you know i got older i they don't fit me like I actually don't buy hats and I asked my dad do you have any hats and he said no so that's the only hat in my house so if it's not funny enough well that's all I have <laughs> um what else is there oh Zach uh game review and Justin it didn't have to be a minute long I watched this video because I was like does it have to be exactly a minute because I was really worried but it doesn't have to be but um Zach, you said to review one of the last games I played, and I'll admit, I played like five different games yesterday and beat them. I, I, I play a lot of video games. Um, one game I'd love to review would probably be... Uh, I don't want to do any... I don't want, I, I don't want to do any new games. Because I don't want to ruin things for people. I feel really bad when I do that. Um... Actually, I'll do Hearthstone, because I've been playing that a lot, and it's really fun. If you guys know what, don't know what Hearthstone is, then here, I'll just sort of know. Um, Hearthstone's a really fun card game, where if... It's an online free card game, is what I should say. That's why most people play it. Uh, if you don't know what it is, definitely look into it. Uh, what, it what it is, if you ever played uh, Yu-Gi-Oh!, uh, Duel Masters, Magic the Gathering, it's a bit different from that. Like... Obviously, all card games are a bit different, but it's the same premises. Get your monsters out, attack your opponent, use spells, yada, yada, yada. When you start the game, you have zero out of zero mana. Uh, if you go first, you get three cards. You can switch out your cards. Like, let's say um, every card costs mana. So let's say you have cards that are like five mana, six mana, eight mana. You're like, I can't use this until I get a lot of mana. I'll switch them out. How you get mana is each turn, uh, when it's your turn, you'll get one mana. And they'll be add, add on to the your maximum mana will be increased by one. So on your first turn, you have one out of one mana. If you have a card that costs one mana, you can use it. And when you use it, you use up one mana. So your next turn, you have two out of two mana, and so forth and so forth. So if you have like if you start with three cards that cost a lot, you're like, I'm gonna switch this out. That's if you go first. If you go second, you get four cards uh, plus a is it a coin? I think it's called, I think it's a coin. You get a coin that'll give you, um, okay, 
right? So if you have one uh, one mana and you're going second, you'll have four cards, whatever they are, whatever your deck is. The coin will add one extra mana just for that turn. Like you, it'll give you one mana without the actual mana slot. So you, if you have one out of one, they give you it gives you two out of one just for that turn. So when you end your turn, it's gone. Uh, the point, the point of the game is actually just to beat your opponents. So when you start off, you have um, what is it? Nine characters. Think you have nine characters to choose from. They each have pre-made decks, and when you beat people, you level up. And when you reach certain levels, you get more cards. It's actually a really great game. Um, I don't really have any problems with it. There's like there's no horrible downsides. Uh, you can add people on it. You can fight your friends. Uh, there's a, there is ranks. You can play ranks. You can play ranks at any moment, which is just a beautiful thing. Uh, I actually didn't even know that. I th I thought you had to be level. T I it actually says 25 under the rank thing, and I thought, oh, I have to be level 25. For, I have to have my character at level 25. But 25 is the ranking you start at, and if you win, you go to you uh, you need to get two stars, then you go up a rank. If you're on a winning spree, they automatically fill two stars, and you keep going. So if you start off at 25, you get you win one game, you get one star, and there's two stars only. I think later on they it goes up to like four and crap. So really great game. If you guys don't know what Hearthstone is, definitely go look it up. Um, other than that, there's not much happening. Really, I've been sick for a bit, so I've just been eating a lot of soup. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions for me, put in the comments below. Um, or, I don't even know, uh, tweet at who's it's gaming. That's my Twitter, and it's very small. Uh, actually, uh, that's what I can talk about. I'm gonna talk to the other nameless nerd people and get our Twitter up and running because I forgot about it until I checked who I was following and I went, oh, we have a Twitter. So I'm actually gonna see if I can bring that up because I know a lot of people and probably a lot of you use Twitter. So I'm looking at the questions trying to figure out if I missed any. I did not. So next week I will have someone on my video. I will cook a better meal. Other than that, have a great time, guys.